Happy October and welcome to Happy Hunting, the only weekly show about hunts here on the Second Life Grid. I am Cinders Vale, your hunt reporter. All three of today's featured hunts are very appropriate for the autumn season. Just wait until you see what I found. I would like to thank the show sponsors, Prim Perfect Publication, Tree TV, Hunt SL, Metaverse Week in Review, and Garden of Dreams. My first hunt is Darkness Falls, a Halloween event at Harshlands. Hunt goes from October 9th to October 31st. This is a Zero Linden store hunt. Be sure to use the teleporter to look on all of the levels. You are looking for 10 pumpkins. I strongly advise you to fly up and hover on occasion. If you have done a hunt at Harshlands before, you know that the hunt objects are usually cleverly hidden in the open. Well, sort of. All of the gifts I'm showing you are copy mod. Skull Candle kind of brings back those old 1950 and 60s atmospheric scary movies. Imagine a few of these around your home or garden. Perfect for Dia Los Motros or Halloween. Next, I have a pair of pumpkin helms. The orange one is regular and the other is rotten. Now you can be the pumpkin warrior that you've dreamed of being. You can have a lot of fun with these. Dark Fungus. Now this has got to be the creepiest fungi that I have ever seen. I just love it. Dark Stalactite. Want to really make that cave of yours more realistic? Then this gift will be just the item to add here and there. Time for a station break. I'll be back after these messages. If you love hunts, be sure to visit Hunt SL, where the goal is to list every hunt on the SL grid so you can find just the hunt you're looking for. HuntSL.com I'm back and ready to show you some gifts from the next hunt. Antique Grid Show Autumn Hunt began on October 10th and ends on November 2nd. This is a grid-wide hunt. Hunt object is a 10 linden pumpkin with the words antique grid show on it. There is an additional free hunt at the end, but more on that later. Silent Woods Uriah Skybox comes in three versions. House without the porch, house with porch and greenery, house with porch without greenery. I've rezzed out the porch and greenery version. This is a skybox that will look great in the air or on the ground. As you can see, I've used the skybox to display a few of the other hunt prizes. On the outside, I've placed two gifts. Now, Do Shop has the autumn porch chair set that comes with two standing animations, one of which I am demonstrating. The leaves, flowers, and pumpkin add that special touch to this gift. Weekend Salvage is giving you the old porch garden table and it has flowers, lamp, even some bricks supporting a leg. Picturesque and homey. Now on the inside of the skybox we have Steaming Ahead's gift is the fully appointed Victorian dining table. The chairs are either male or female and come with eating animations. This is quite a handsome gift. Next, I've grouped two gifts together. Spargel's Madison Fireplace in Stone with its touch on and off fire is old world comfort for those autumn nights. On the mantle is the gift from Shabby Tabby. Victorian pumpkins is a very different from your usual pumpkin decor. The slightly worn and rusty bird cage with the decorated pumpkins inside make it special. At the end of the hunt, be sure to check out the Antique Grid Show Haunted House Hunt. You'll get the landmark to the location when you finish the hunt. When you get to the haunted house, just click on the hunt poster to get the note card. Find five of the pumpkins and each will give you a clue to the next pumpkin. When you get all five, you get to go to the prize box. 
just look at all those extra goodies. And these are free prizes. Happy Hunting is going to take a short station break. Stay tuned to see today's third featured hunt. Fearless Nation is providing education and raising awareness about post-traumatic stress disorder to banish stigma and inform the public. Fearless Nation PTSD support, putting virtual reality technology to work in trauma recovery. Visit this 501c3 nonprofit at www.fearless-nation.org. That's www.fearless-nation.org. Let's see the next group of hunt gifts. Watercolors in the Rain Hunt Quest runs from October 1st and goes until December 31st. This hunt is located on a Linden Endowment for the Arts Sim. The real life novel, Watercolors in the Rain by David Levine is used across the Sim to recreate chapters from the novel. Enjoy the surroundings while you hunt for the White Raven, which is also from the novel. Autumn Falling Leaves with Blinking Owl will be a great addition to your outdoors. I think the Blinking Owl gives added character to this great gift. Winter Chandelier with on and off lights will add a wonderful glow to your home. And it might just start you thinking about the coming holidays. The set of three Victorian picture frames reminds you of the time when people went to photography studios for portraits. I wonder what the stories are behind these particular portraits. The Victorian fireplace with on and off fire also comes with the fire irons. No matter what style your home is, contemporary, colonial, or a castle, this pair of gifts will look very well there. Small Victorian side table with bud vase is quite a nice gift. Just the right size to fit almost anywhere in your home or business. The last gift I'm showing today is the on and off lamp post. At only two prim and copyable, you could line a sidewalk, pathways, or a courtyard with this gift. That wraps up Happy Hunting today. Watch Happy Hunting every weekend on happyhuntingtv.wordpress.com, huntsl.wordpress.com, treat TV, and on a view TV. Come visit our Happy Hunting headquarters in Broken Creek. Check out the viewer for our latest episode on the Upper Terrace, or enjoy the ocean view. Best of all, you can pick up your ballot for the 2015 Hunties Award on the lower level. Some of your favorite stores have the green and gold kiosks also. Fill out the ballot, then bring it back to the Hunties mailbox and drop it in. This year, there are 19 categories to help make it easier. This is a great way to give some recognition to those merchants and hunt organizers that you believe have done their best to give you a great hunt experience. You have until midnight on New Year's Eve. Next weekend, things should be a little bit more Halloween-y. Until then, let's go hunting.